Okay, and here is the long-awaited dorm hall part two. It's been a while. I know. I've been working really hard to get all my shopping done, and I finally, finally did. I leave for college on Saturday, and it's currently Sunday, so I guess you can call this like my seven-day countdown, even though I don't think I'm going to post a video every day. I have a few that I am going to post. I think I have like four uh, or five, including this one, so... I, honestly, this is gonna be long like the other one. It's a lot of more little stuff and just things I didn't get before so I Think I'm gonna first say the things that I'm not gonna show you um, or that my roommate got and Then we'll move into all the things I have sitting here in front of me So yeah without any further ado. Here's my dorm hall part two. I'm so excited Okay, so my roommate got a Keurig and she has these little like multicolored fun uh, knit rug things for our room, two of them, and then what else? Oh, she's bringing her TV, and then um, I have a full-length mirror that I've not shown you, and then people ask me questions about like my mini fridge and microwave. Our room actually comes with a mini fridge and a microwave already in it. It's part of our um, our dorm cost in the first place, so I don't have to worry about that stuff, which is really, really nice. It's actually a nice mini fridge too. It has like the freezer compartment at the top, and the microwave's nice, like it's all, it's all really nice. So yeah, we have all of that. And I think that's it as far as like the big things that I'm just not going to show you. Everything else is kind of sitting over here. So yes, on to the things that I do have sitting here in front of me. The first thing I have is some towels. So I have this one in this like fun gray and white pattern. And then I have this one that's just a solid gray. And then I have a hand towel, and then I have this huge set of washcloths um, because I have the tendency to get makeup all over my washcloths and get them really dirty really fast. So I just got a huge set in dark colors so I could clean them really, really easily. And the next thing I have sitting here in front of me is a storage bin. I got three of these and they might seem a little like fancy or excessive, um, but I was looking at these, these plastic bins for on top of my closet and these were a dollar more and like a million times cuter. I could reuse these. So I decided to go with these and I'm really, really glad that I did. I'm just hoping, fingers crossed, that they fit. I think they might be too tall. We'll see. That to be decided. We'll look at that later on. I got these bins for under my bed. I got three of them from the container store and they're like gray and clear. And yeah, they're stackable, so I'm gonna put these under my bed. I have like a dresser thing too, but I just wanted a little bit of extra storage. So yeah, I'm gonna bring these, and they're really nice, like quality and everything like that. And they have like a little warranty on them and everything, which I think was really nice for just random plastic bins. And they were a little bit more expensive than like the ones at Walmart and Target, but I'm just hoping that because I've spent that money, they'll just they'll hold up so much better. Hopefully, hopefully. All right, and then I got this nice little bed bug, like waterproof allergy protector cover. Uh, my mom really recommended this. She actually like got it for me and it's waterproof protection and household allergen protection and it's a bed bug barrier fabric for um, a twin XL, so yay. And then I got this little tiny flip it fan that um, is gonna sit right next to my bed, a little one. Oh, that's another thing my roommate is bringing. She has a giant uh, like floor fan kind of thing. I mean, it's not really giant. It's like one of those long and skinny ones, um, but she has that that she's bringing for us, which is super awesome. Love you, Carol. Um, okay, and then I have a couple of bags sitting in front of me. I have my Vera Bradley tote that matches my cosmetic case in the print Parisian Paisley. And then I have one more travel tote, um, and it's just blue. I don't know what brand it is, really. I got it from Target. Um, and this is what I'm going to use to pack for my leadership camp in, Camp Blue, and then I'll use it to like come home on the weekends and things of that sort. And then I have my little gym bag. Um, and the only thing in my gym bag right now are my boxing hand wraps. Um, so yeah, that's about all that's in there. All right, moving on to everything I got to do my laundry. Here, sitting in front of me, I have this giant thing of the Tide Pods. I have Shout Color Catchers because, honestly, I would ruin all of my clothes if I didn't have them. And then I have um, dryer sheets that 
smell like spring renewal. They just smell like really florally, kind of lavendery, and I quite like that. And then I also have um, some lingerie bags. So I have two little ones and two sweater ones. Um, so I can wash a lot of my delicate clothes and things like that in those, which I do have quite a bit of. And then I have these two jumbo lint rollers. They had like a little two for deal going on at Target that made them really, really cheap. So that was nice. And then I have Tide to go sticks because I'm notorious for spilling things on myself, AKA coffee, pasta sauce. Basically if it stains, I'll spill it. And then I have Wrinkle Whiz, which is like wrinkle spray. And this only works on certain materials, um, but I do like it for like silky shirts like this. It really does take all of those harsh wrinkles right out of it, which sounds kind of crazy, but it does work and I like it a lot and I thought it would be a useful addition to my uh, college um, closet. Yes. All right, and then I have a few things for cleaning. I have this giant thing of Clorox disinfecting wipes and I have a dustpan and brush set. And then my roommate is bringing us one of those um, Swiffer things. I think she said it was like pink or something. So yeah, she has one of the Swiffer things and like the pads for them and all of that. And yes. And then I have some like beauty and hair care and just other things that I got um, that I kind of needed to stock up on that I knew I'd need. And so I have um, this shampoo and conditioner from Herbal Essences. They're the Wild Naturals. And these ones smell like Turkish fig or something like that. I don't know. They kind of smell like they're just very fruity. And they're all natural, so I like that. I'm using another natural shampoo right now, and I'm going to finish them because I have them, but I don't really like them. They don't suds up, and somebody on YouTube was talking about these and said that they suds up really well, like the, um, the shampoo lathers, and that doesn't happen a lot with natural ingredient products, so I'm going to give these a shot. And then I have the Olay Ultra Moisture Coconut Oasis to make my skin nice and soft. And then I have a family pack of mini bath sponges, the loofahs. Um, and yes, they're all different little gradient colors of blue. I thought that was cute. And then I have this mini razor and razor heads. Yay. And then I have baby wipes. And you might be thinking this is the weirdest thing in the entire world, but I keep these things everywhere. Um, I keep them by my makeup vanity to get like, if I put like foundation on my hands and then I need to wipe it off, like I use that. If I like do the lipstick trick with the finger, like I wipe it off with these. Um, if I go to the gym or if I run and I just like don't really need, feel the need to like shower completely, I kind of use these to freshen up um, or just freshen up in general. Like they're honestly, these are my like holy grail and I get them in refreshing cucumber because I like the smell of them and I don't like to smell like a baby. I like just the nice cucumber smell of them. So yes, there's those. And then I have some extra toothbrushes and these little like flip bit things that stay over the head of the toothbrush. So I'm carting it back and forth if I like accidentally drop it on the floor. It's not gonna get all gross and disgusting. And then I have these little placker flosser things that I use um, because I'm totally uncoordinated and I can't use normal floss, don't ask. And then I have 75 hair ties and a bunch of bobby pins. So I think I'm gonna be set for a little while, but I don't know, those things tend to go missing. Give this video a thumb up if you literally lose every single ponytail and bobby pin that you buy because I know I do. And then for my kind of random stuff, I have a bajillion in one command hooks. I have these little ones that I think I'm gonna use for canvases. I have these ones that are gonna be used for towels. I have the, um, the command like picture framing ones that everybody recommended and these ones are the medium strips and these ones are the uh, large strips and the medium hold up to 12 pounds and the large hold up to 16 so i'm hoping that i'll be able to hang all of like those heavy picture frames with these wish me luck um and thank you to everybody who recommended those because i went looking for them because of you wonderful wonderful people and then i also got this lovely um, external hard drive. No, it did not come in this. This is like a Target pillowcase holder set thing, but I got the um, Western Digital, my Passport Ultra, and I just configured it for my Mac. It's one terabyte, um, so I can keep everything for my YouTube channel on my external hard drive, so it's not taking up room on my computer itself. And then I got a few little decorative items. I got this cute little jar, this coppery 
jar from Target, which I thought was just adorable. And honestly, did I really need this? No, probably not. But it's super cute, and I literally looked at it seven times in a row and then was like, okay, I've walked past this thing ten times and I still want it. And so I got it. And then this was on the clearance rack at Target, and it's just like a little... Um, it's supposed to be a planter, but I'm going to use it for my bracelets because the other bowl for my bracelets that I have right now is getting way too small for all of my bracelets. So yes, this will be used for my bracelets. And then I have a few little just random things. It's all so random. I have these little stick-on lights um, that we're going to use on the top of our closet. So when one of us is getting up in the morning and doesn't want to wake the other person up or like late at night, you know, whatever, um, we'll have these stuck to the top of the closet so you can just press them and turn them on. And then there's not a light in the entire room. It's just like these little lights at the top there. So I thought that would be neat. And then I have one extra one that I think there's some shelves um, above one of like where we're going to have our beds. And I was thinking about sticking that under there and using it as a reading light, but I'm really not sure. So we'll see how that goes. And then I have this giant thing of band-aids and some Neosporin. Um, we're kind of going halvesies with our first aid kit and just getting different random things we need so yeah i was in charge of this so i got those and then i got a swiss army knife because i've always kind of wanted one of these and like they're really useful and this was kind of like an expensive thing to just dish out for randomly but i i honestly think it will come in handy um so we'll see i'll let you know did it come in handy did it not we'll find out then I got this little sewing kit from Walmart, which was like in the college section, like they were clearly advertising it for college students. Um, but I am quite handy with hand sewing, so I needed something to bring of my own. And then I got these little sets of Kleenexes to have in my purse. I also got some mini deodorants that are in my purse currently. I got this mini little spray bottle for my uh, air plants to water them. And for those days where your hair has that one piece that's like sticking up like this and you don't want to shower and you don't want to use heat, so you just like spray it down and fix it. Honestly, that might be just a short hair thing or like a boy hair thing, but oh well. And I got a new Camelback. Um, this one is a one liter and I really wanted the bigger one and I wanted one that didn't have other college uh, logos on it, so I got... Like, I'm still going to have the BC one, but this is the one I'm going to be using all the time. And then I got some bag clips for any food we might have in our room. And I got this cute little floral umbrella that kind of looks like it goes with my bedspread a little too well. And then I got these two, which were just something fun to end this off. And they're from Knock Knock. And they're the pads. This one is the Awesome Citation. And the other one is the pep talk. And I just thought those would be really cute to have and to like write people little notes and to make friends with. Like I just thought they would be something really neat to have um, while I was at college. And I saw them and I was just like, oh, those are cute. I'm going to get them. So yes, this concludes my dorm haul part two. Please give this video a thumb up if you enjoyed it and like and subscribe and be sure to follow my other social media and keep up with me and my move in um, to answer some questions I've been getting in the comments. Yes, I am doing a move in blog, um, but it will be up pretty late. I move in Saturday, but I also am going to a leadership camp. Um, so I'm just going to compile all of that together once I'm like settled in um, later on in the week. So I will I will let you know when that's going to be up. Um, I'll make sure. I'll make sure that it gets up sometime within that week. Like, it, it'll be there. And I'm also doing a few other college-related videos this week, so keep an eye out for those. And I will see you guys in the next one. Stay classy. Bye-bye.